What craziness can we do with Minecraft? Today we test to see if you can really send items from the end to the overworld. It's the first episode of Counter Theory, only on Counter Punch TV. Hello viewers, this is Counter Punch TV and welcome to a new series I hope to keep going, which is Counter Theory. Which is me just thinking of weird stuff to test out in the world of Minecraft. And my first one is one that we talk about on the nation but never know how to execute and that is can stuff from the end be teleported to the old world and as you see I built a portal my coordinates here are this is my spawn uh, 1787 at minus 74 and I've already killed the dragon so let's just hop in and I, I like this, this is I didn't know you could spawn like this okay, the dragon's dead portal somewhere over here and we got 64 cobble ready. We're gonna toss them in and see where they end up if they do. Because I heard that Doc has done this, but I don't know. Let's put some over here. See if that makes a difference. Put some over here. We okay. I got 22 left. So let's hop in see if they do come out. Oh, there's some there. So, oh, I'm off by one. Hmm. So let's just see. This is 64. I wanted to make sure I know where the block is. It's this one. That's yeah, a whole stack. So let's put that there. So they do come to the old world, but how does this work? You know what? I'm going to test this out a little bit more. Test number two. Let's, oops, let's just jump in. Okay, where are they? I'm further away, but the blocks go to the same area. This area is 72 minus 17. What's the difference between a normal human and a scientist? When you touch that your fence, a human will know not to try it again. A scientist will see if it actually does it again. Let's see, falling through, and that block is right there. It's um, moving further away, apparently. But it, it always goes back to this one. It's off the side of it. It keeps coming back. Now, Let's see if I enclose. I don't know. If I enclose this area, will it spawn inside, or will it spawn on top of it? Okay, so we have this here. We're gonna just jump in. It's encased. And off to here. Fly up. Select my cobble. I don't need to throw it in there. Stacking so randomly again. Just probably throw a few. Maybe half. Half is easy. Let's see. Bye bye. In you go. And in I go. Go back here. And it's on top. Hmm. So it's going to appear on this block. So let's see. If it'll appear in the sky. Let's try this high. And. Whoa! I missed. Fail. One more time with feeling. And a twist! Okay, we're through and. Oh, 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 this is. This is different. So you are, Ooh, which block are you on? I think you're more on this one. 177 minus 74. So let's actually try that again. Let's see if this actually makes it random now. And it's in and go. We're back and okay. Whoa, no, no, what? Let's 
Okay. Uh. So they're random up to if there's no space there. So it's going back to here now. One more time. And then we go again. Probably not the last time. And it's back there, so that makes it random. I don't know. To what point. Let's go up here and knock this down a bit and see if it fixes itself or I just ruined the entire thing. So, oh, I have a bat somewhere. So when it was this tall, it went on top. So let's try it now. Here we go again. Back out, and it's back on top. Hmm. I wonder why. A little bat. Let me try this out for a bit. So I raise it by one block. Of that, and it's back on the ground. Is it because it's a pillar? We're back, and it's on top. Uh huh. Let's make it a tall platform up here. And there fail. Okay, this looks promising. Yes, it's up here now. I wonder. So high can make it go. And let's see, this could be the last one, if I'm lucky. Hear that bat again. So it's not down here. Okay, so it's up here. Now, it likes this spot. It really does, but it has to have stuff around it. 1782 minus 70. Not much as information is going to help. But you see, there's my original spawn, there's one that spawns at the, the items when it was just a pillar. So, I suppose if you're trying to make items go from the end to the oval world automatically, you would need to first make a flat surface and see where the blocks come in. It shouldn't be too hard, especially if you use a large cobble. But yeah, that would do it. I, I want to try um, slabs. Because if you use slabs, you can use hoppers very, very easily. I'm going to take some of this down. Alright, so I'm going to do some quick slabs on the top half. My theory is it should work the same way. If not, it should appear inside or randomly around. So let's see. Want to go in there, Bat? You can come in if you want. And it goes, and in I go. Well, I'm really close to the pillar this time. So where is it? It's on top. On the center. So that works. Now, let's see. If I put it like this, it'll appear there. And they go and I go. So, yeah, they're on top. Hmm. <laughs> so, it doesn't matter if it's a slab or a whole block, or a blast would work. Let's play the series, guys. It's continuously testing. So, in they go. And then I go. Back out, and yes, it's on top. 
<laughs> this is awesome, actually, but you're going to need to figure out where they land. Let me get some hoppers and actually see what's the full benefit of this chest. So let's put a chest right here. Yes, I know, it's just, it's just for fun, guys. So I put it right here. Let's see, put this around. So I sell 64. If it lands right there, on top of the hopper, oh, <clears throat> on top of the hopper, sorry, it will go in and ta-da. However, maybe the hopper is going to cause a glitch. Let's throw them in. Throw B in. Okay, I'm back, and they're not there. Are they in here? Yes, they're going in. So they land on top and went inside. So this is completely doable in pretty much any game mode, I believe. I don't know why it wouldn't work in in uh, survival, but you just need to figure out where this one block is. I I know Doc M has done this before, but I don't know if he's actually made something that moves stuff from the end to the overworld. But this is my original spawn, and it's very close to where I spawn. There's no set number. Let me put that number on the screen again. Maybe it's a chunk corner or a chunk center. The center will make sense. Let's see, so it's at the six and six block by ninth block in the chunk. So it doesn't really tell me much. Where's the eighth? The eighth is over here. That's the uh, midpoint. Hmm. Well, that's only in the plotter boat. Well, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later. Bye.